Hi everyone, uh, this is Piper, and today I'm going to be walking you through how to set up Ezoic's Ad Tester on a WordPress site. So the first thing you're going to want to do is integrate your site. You can do, you do that by changing your name servers or uh, through Cloudflare if you're already a Cloudflare customer. We're going to skip that step and go on to setting up ad testing. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is copy and paste this script into the head area of your website. So I just copied that and then I come over to my WordPress dashboard and for this I actually used a plugin. I used the header and footer plugin. So if you come to settings, header and footer, you can go ahead and enter it right here and this will show on every page of your site. So click save and we'll go back here. All right, step two. Uh, we had no existing ads on the site, so we have nothing to convert. If you do have ads on your site already, you're gonna either wanna convert them or wrap them, and we have some support articles on that. So skipping ahead, I'm gonna walk you guys through creating one or two ad units, um, and then you should get the hang of it. So click over here, add ad unit. So this one we're going to do, um, let's start with the top of the page. So top of page. And here you can toggle which devices are going to see the ad. If, if this little icon is green, it means that it will show up on that device. If it's gray, it means it won't. Uh, and we already pre-populated it for the ones that should show on certain devices. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and just do desktop. And for this one, I'm going to do all the horizontal and um, all the boxes. Create the ad. Perfect. So I'll go ahead and copy that one. So then I use the insert post ads plugin. There's tons of plugins out there that you can use, but this is just one. Um, so I'll show you how that's done. You go right here and add new and insert the code here and then here you can specify where the advertisement is going so you can do before content after a certain paragraph number this is super useful if you're doing under first paragraph under second paragraph mid content long content etc and then bottom so we're going to do before content publish perfect Okay, so let's add another ad unit. Uh, let's do one um, under the first paragraph. Oops. And let's do all the horizontals, all the boxes, and all the buttons and create the ad. Copy this. And you're just going to go back here into the edit post advert, add new. Uh, under first paragraph at after paragraph number one and publish so that's how you do the post adverts um, the sidebar is a little bit different I've already created a sidebar one so you can see so you go ahead and grab the code so we'll get that code and then if you go over into your widgets, you will have these text widgets. Uh, you can just drag it from down here up into your sidebar. And so I put one up here and that includes this sidebar code that I created. Uh, and then down here is another sidebar ad. So they're in different positions so the system can test different sizes and different positions and things like that. Okay, now as you, I'm just fast forwarding so you guys can see, um, I've created all these ad units and I've gone ahead and put them on, on our site. So if I go to the site, and then I'm going to go ahead and use the Chrome extension, fetch the changes, only show indicators. Okay. So here you can see we have our top of the page ad under the first paragraph, under the second, mid content, bottom of the page and then these two in the sidebar. And then what you can do is you can expand them to see what the various sizes you've selected will look like. Um, so you can see all these here. There we go. 
So hopefully this gave you an overview of how to use Ad Tester with WordPress. As I mentioned, you can place as many ad placeholders as you like on the site and the system will test to find the best ad combinations of them. So if you have any questions, uh, please email support at ezoic.com and thanks everyone for your time.